do you want to learn how to edit youtube shorts how to get that resolution for the shorts video this all you will be learning in this video and there will be an improvisation tip at the end so first of all import your clip in the sony vegas i will be teaching you how to edit your youtube shorts video in sony vegas so i have the sony vegas 15 so first of all you you have to go into that project video properties and in this section you have to change the width and the height the normally it would be 1920 by 1080 you have to just reverse the resolution 1080 and here it will be 1920 that's all and hit apply hit ok first you have to make a new video track so press ctrl u on the video track and hit uh, ctrl and drag your clip up to make a copy of it hit the pan and crop icon of the topmost layer and right click match output aspect so it will be like this you have to just drag it out until you are satisfied how much you want to show it on your video actual video so in the bottom of the clip you have to do the same pan and crop option right click and match output in this you will not drag out the you know stretch out the area it will be rem it will remain like this obviously it doesn't look good go into the video effects go into the gaussian blur go to medium blur and apply that in the bottom layer so this creates a nice blurry effect in the background for the topmost layer to make it more pop out go to sapphire plugins s drop shadow and this is the blur preset that i already have i will be applying that here you can see the preset once that's done so already you have done most of the work let's look at the clip now the clip shows my jumping shot the first kill here i have done this now let's edit uh, which part you want to show into the video which you don't want to show okay i will just time lapse that part so the shorts video is properly done you know i've just given a, a normal fade effect just given a fade out effect at the end and a fade in effect at the start so it's like a 20 second shorts video which I have done. I don't usually put any effects in the background like a meme or any. I give it a nice uh, color correction to the video. I, uh, I apply sharpen. Apply sharpen. This is the. I do it in the top layer. This is the amount 0.2. I go to SHSL U Satch. You can see the settings. And I also apply HSL adjust best settings and you can see the settings you can just copy it if you want to apply the same things so the short video is ready for me this is how i make my youtube shorts the tip that i want to give which you can improvise insert a new video track and go to media generators and go to legacy text or you know normal text styles and text you can go to that drag and drop and write uh, like and subscribe in the blur if blur parts you know bottom and the top parts or you can simply put any text you know normally i would put some music behind it but in this shorts i don't need it shorts video is basically done now so i will just disable the resample of the video tracks uh, i will select and disable resample and now i will just render it out the shorts video file render as go to i will sh show you how to render this shorts video go to a magic avc mvc a4 this is a short preset which i already have I will show you so the customizing template you will see the width and the height is remains the reversed same as the project settings the frame rate it's depends it depends on you I will, I will keep it 60 fps i have done maximum bit rates and you know encode mode is an nv encoder high quality so this is all the settings of my render settings i would just render it out and i would name it as jumping shots shots okay so i would just render it out so once the video is rendered go to the folder where the clip is saved so now my my fold my video is saved in the desktop so first of all go to the chrome go to youtube and how to i will show you how to upload a youtube shorts video and then upload video so here you come where you have to upload your video so drag and drop your file and yeah now you would just uh, type in your title what will be a good title i will just name it as valorant jumping shots precise gunplay okay and i would add a hashtag shots at the end i would just copy this and add it in my description enter enter 
and then i would just modify my description a bit no tags required while uploading a shorts video just like a normal video just put in everything so our video has been completed and i would upload as a private video and public it after some time so yeah now the video has been done just putting the tag hashtag shorts in the end it will it will show up in the youtube shorts section so now you're ready to upload your own youtube shorts content good luck and thanks for watching this video i'll see you guys later peace